Tiabulisa Betuna, Ikamalam de Muslim Dile. Welcome to the podcast, Yami Bizon, Unstrong Life with Slee. Uh, today, I brought this gentleman here. His name is D. How are you doing? I'm fine, and you? I'm well and excited, of course. That's right. Uh, I'm so excited that I will be cross questioning you. Okay, maybe I'll be, I want to be part of the conversation, but mostly I wrote so many things that I want to ask because I'm so curious about it. And the reason for this, mm -hmm. I had a conversation with a friend of mine who felt um, that uh, the, the partner disrespected him, questioning mm. his manhood and all of that. Mm. So now the question is, is it wrong to sit your partner down mm -hmm. and address the fact that you're not happy sexually? It's not wrong and it will never be wrong from my point of view. Mm -hmm. This is where you are seated as partners. Mm. Even friends do die for friends. So mm. what would be so bad if your partners will set you down and tell you this is what you are doing and I, I'm not happy with it? Okay, so you, you're saying that we have to sit and talk about such encounters with our partners. Yes. But why... Okay, I'm going to go back again. I felt, okay, how I experienced this, I felt like my friend got offended. Mm. He got offended. He felt like he was disrespected. Mm. So now, in a, in, a, in a sense that when do you think it's the right time to sit and talk about it with your partner? <laughs> Second question mm. is that what is the best way? Mm. When? Mm -hmm. How? When and how? When? Okay. No how? Yes. Okay, so we are partners, mm. for instance. Mm. I wouldn't come to you to talk to you about issues that are bothering us or bringing the relationship down mm -hmm. when you are not in the mood. In, in I, what believe, I believe, I believe you, you are not getting it, so I'm going, yes, to, I'm going yes. to rephrase it. How will you know that I'm in the mood to yes. hear such? Yes. For instance, let's say you come back from work, mm. tired, you have to cook for mm. your man, you've done all that. Mm. And then your man comes in without touching the food and then starts questioning you. To be honest, you're going to tell him he's nagging, so you're tired and you're going to sleep. Mm. But this is where that, that goes with when. When okay. and so, how. When and how. Mm. So one. Men are moved by what they see. So as a partner, if you want to talk to him, let him see something he might crave or something. Hmm. Let's bring it down. Mm. Your man comes home and you're looking like a magogo. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and you're looking like a mag magogo with all tattered and stuff and then food is on the dining and stuff. Just like that, and then you just leave and go and sleep. How would he be able to talk to you? Hmm. No. But he comes in, the moment he gets to the door, you are there yes. to welcome him. Yes. Whatever transpired whilst he was at work or whilst he was coming back, hmm. is not going to enter the house. will be left at the entrance. Hmm. One thing that men are made of, is to have peace. So if you're a partner and you're always yelling at your men, trust me, someone somewhere out there will give him peace and he will be snatched. So you mean that sometimes the sex drive, it's, it, 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 sex drive it, it, it goes down because of the situation at home if you have a partner who's not peaceful, who's always nagging and yelling? It's not even, not, not even the peaceful side. I told you before, most men mm. or real men are mm. moved by what they see. Mm. Yes. So I should so, always be on point. Yes. Ha. Huh. Yes. But what happens that mm. as well, I go to work mm -hmm. long hours. Mm -hmm. I have to go fetch kids. Mm -hmm. And remember, I have to wake up, mm -hmm. prepare for kids, mm -hmm. prepare for you and breakfast and all that. Go to work, come back, 
do help kids to do homework. Let's say you work mm -hmm. longer hours than me mm -hmm. and I'm the one who gets home first. Mm -hmm. I still have to cook. When will I have time now to, to enhance? For, from my point of view, then again, the reason why I'm always using that is, mm. this is why I have a beautiful lady, mm. have beautiful kids. You are my priority. I have to defend with my life. Make sure everything is on point. Yours is to feed us and make us feel at home. That is all. Leave the rest for the man. Hmm. Men are always on, on the point that oh, they always want you to know, do this and it's done. Whenever you do that, you will never have problems with him. I'm talking of real men. Okay. Not some crazy dudes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So the whole thing is, in my in my view or my point, I don't mind waking up, making sure the kids are ready whilst you do the kitchen stuff. Okay. Remember, it's a partnership. Yeah. I'm not supposed to leave. You're not a slave. Yeah, I no. like that. Mm. You're never a slave. Mm -hmm. And mostly, I, I, I came to see your family, maybe buy cows and stuff, yeah. give them as your bride price and stuff. Mm. So after bringing you home, we are one. So therefore, we have to work together. For instance, my mother and my father got separated, yes. But there was not a single time I can boast off and say my mother and my father were arguing. Never. Mm. They talk. They have time to talk. Okay. And none of the kids saw that. Mm -hmm. They went, my mother yelling or my father yelling or something. Mm -hmm. Never. Okay. You understand? Because they understand each other. And some people make the mistake of going for a wrong partner because of something he saw or something he knew this person could do for. Okay. So when you get fed up of that, the whole thing comes crashing. Hmm. Yes. So, so it was more of a last, more than defend. connection. It was more of last yes. than connection. Yep. And then now, I, hmm. I, I, as, I, as I was doing a bit of research, I've discovered that most men, sometimes they say um, they have some low sex drive because of maybe they're going through some mental issues, stresses and all that. And then others, maybe there's something wrong with their system hmm. or maybe they ended up not finding you attractive. There's something about uh, most black guys or some black guys, mm -hmm. or let's say Africans. Yes. Uh, most of them are like, the women they go home, they see their partner and they feel like having something, they just put you down brrr, and they are done. Yeah. But this is where you're supposed to be playing to get all this work stuff off your mind. So that you wake up the next day fully energetic, then you will know how to handle certain things. Hmm. Yes. In my line of work, when I'm working and I make a mistake, I just stop, go out, feel the air, relax and hmm. think. I'll come back and fix whatever that went wrong. Okay. That is it. But now we're fixing it at work, <laughs> but you will still find Uslin at home who's a Godzilla. Who will remind you something you did yesterday or last week? Yes, that is another problem. Yeah. So, for instance, if I come home and this is what you're doing, mm. I come home, Godzilla is ready. <laughs> Godzilla. Waiting for me to shoot laser beams at Yeah, me. yeah, yeah. What do you think will happen if I should have, let's say, a secretary in my office mm. who is always calm, trying to talk to me, always mm. trying to see me from afar? What mm. do you think will happen? I will by all means feel okay with her. Okay. Than to come home. Do you rather work late hours? Yes. And come back, sleep? Yes. And then now, if I'm your woman mm. and I discover that we're having this problem, mm -hmm. that maybe our the, the, maybe you, the libido is down, maybe mm. you ejaculate early, mm. or maybe it doesn't even go up mm. and I sit you down mm. and then maybe I come and say, babe, I understand that you've been going through some things. Mm. I acknowledge that mm. and I've been trying to easy up mm. and it, 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 we had peace me and you. Yeah. I think maybe it's something to do with your system now. Mm. Would you allow me to advise you maybe to go see the doctor or go see a sangoma maybe to give you mm. things that can boost your system for us to be happy at home? This... Like I said before, we are partners. 
if I see something wrong with, for, from your side, yes. I should be able to tell you not mm -hmm. to keep it inside. Okay. Men don't complain because they don't want to be seen weak. Mm -hmm. You understand? Yes. And sometimes if that happens and you want to help him, it all drives at how you're going to say it, how his mood is before mm -hmm. saying that, and how to push him. And you know, some men have this, men don't like to be shamed. Mm. Oh, that is why I think your friend that told yeah, you yeah, that yeah. felt offended. Mm. In it the midst be, of an argument. In the midst of an argument, then you mm. start saying, you don't even satisfy me, you can do this mm. for me. To be honest, I will find someone that will appreciate me. Yeah. So simple. Yeah, because he said now. And then the kids become a liability. So I have no option than to hit here and hit here. And, and try and make back. things back. Which is not going to work. So women kill men always. Aisha. And now our population is still dropping. <laughs> yeah. We have to marry nine and ten women. At Your population time. is yes. dropping. <laughs> I'm only praying that uh, let's say in a hundred years or two hundred years time yeah. we we'll still have men on this planet. Yeah, you think so? But we are decreasing. Hmm. Anyway, I'm not offended. Because with... if anything goes wrong, women and children go and hide. Leave the men to die. <laughs> I actually I don't get off. I'm not offended with what you said about having many wives because I believe in that. I believe in polygamy yeah. and all that. And so in 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 all of this, there are certain ways to solve this thing. It doesn't mean that your man is entirely um, low in erection and all that. If there are certain things, the whole thing is know your man. Know your man. Know, know your, your man. man. When he's coming back from work and mm. you see him through the window, you should mm. be able to tell that he is okay. He's not okay. Let me quickly meet him. Cause, meet cause him, others... a, a warm hug or a kiss can change the whole mood. And that is how men are. Mm. The moment that comes in, he puts everything behind him, hides it. Okay. So maybe after eating and a shower or something, when you go to bed, just cuddle him and then tell him, baby, what happened? Mm. I saw you are not okay today. Okay. Please open up to me. Okay. Sometimes they wouldn't tell you. Some men will not tell you because they think it's something they can handle. Mm. Yes. Mm. Mm. More especially when it comes to stresses that has nothing mm. to do with you something at one. home. No, 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 no. Why, is, why do you think that if you don't... Let me understand mm. that, baby, it's not you mm. who's making me to be in this position or in this you know, situation. Ladies, you, you have, Tell me. You I'm know, your you partner. Know, you know, you Tell know. me that, baby, I'm going through <laughs> okay, some I'm things. Okay, but, but it has nothing to do with you. You know that mm. thing? Because it's so painful to find your men not touching you. Let me show you, you the reason why they do that. One. When a man sets his mind on something, yeah, it's straightforward. Nothing comes across it. Nothing can distract him. He's just going forward. Balance the equation. Till he's done. Balance the equation. Now, let's look at women. When a woman wakes up, especially mm. when you have kids, mm. you have work, you have stuff to do, mm. you have to go to market. Yeah, yeah. All those things have been combusted in your mind True. and your brain starts shaking. That's why you people grow faster. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because it's like every single muscle, every single cell is clean. We mm. have to do that. We have to yeah, do yeah. that. And mm. it's all working like that. Okay. Yes. So at the end of the day, if I should tell you, babe, this doesn't concern you. It's not you. I don't have a problem with you. I'm okay with you. And uh, I'll I don't start think to be worried it. as well. I want to I wanna you interject. You never agree. Oh, I will still think that it's me. Yes. Okay. That is the mistake women do. Mm. And the mistake with men. I have told you it's not your problem. For instance, let's say I used to be a bodyguard. Mm. I've been in a gunfight and a whole lot of stuff. Yes. And uh, when I'm going and I have anyone I think will be worried when I'm not back. First of all, when I go in a relationship with you, I'll tell you when you call me, on three occasions, I don't pick up for three days. Take it as I'm dead. Ah. So simple. Because if I don't, I don't, I don't call you back. I don't reply your messages for three solid days. 
it doesn't mean I'm, I doesn't make sense of course no 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 mm. maybe I'm, I'm i'm lost i'm gone yeah something is wrong you should yes. just know mm. and rule number two you only listen to what i say when i call you and tell you babe leave home leave home with the kids go okay because i know how my work is you understand so if i should have a Godzilla like you <laughs> at home and i tell you, babe leave home it's now you're going to ask why me, why should i leave home? yeah yeah babe i said leave home sometimes i'm at, but i need to know that is why i'm telling you it's a partnership yeah i should make you know every single thing okay the ones that will keep you safe and the ones that is dangerous to you i'll just tell you when i give you a command just follow it i hear you do you understand mm -hmm. so i'll just tell you babe leave home go to your mother mm. i know why i'm saying that okay when it's cool and there's one more thing too if your man loves you mm. and he's doing a dangerous work and he's going and he tells you i will be back i should have faith in that stop him so i should support the fact yes. that you might die no 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 it's not that have the belief that he will come back just that you can keep okay. him going i've seen people get shot and they still wake up and still move we had an accident some time ago and uh this was where a baby came through the windscreen the windshield of the car mm -hmm. fell on the street and this man had one leg broken one arm fucked up he came out of the car and he was still walking on the broken leg mm -hmm. to pick the baby after picking the baby went back off ripped the gates off bring out the lady mm -hmm. that is men i hear you so now what is it with men that they if maybe and, 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 and there's, there's one thing to wait with before you ask your question there are difference between a man and a boy what's the difference yes men would do what i just said okay but boys wouldn't even think of how you're doing or something so know how your partner is you choose you have to choose between if you want a boy or you want a man that is the whole thing so now what is it with men mm. maybe if they discover mm. that they have some sexual problems mm. let's uh, say maybe i haven't addressed it to you mm -hmm. and then why is it most of men they go outside and test if the problem is with them or it's with the partner they don't find them attractive why, why, why they always want to go and check somewhere first to understand if the problem is with them or it's at home in the beginning i told you men are moved by what they see so in order to know that he still can perform or not perform mm. okay why don't i try this and see mm. and for all you know to you he's not performing mm. um you start nagging at home mm. someone somewhere is giving him peace mm. so therefore he have no option than to jump into that and then do men and if he goes there and he performs perfectly then that means you are in serious danger Oh, trouble. Fine. Mm. But would you admit mm. when you have a problem as a man that yes, I have a problem, I need help? Yes, that is what I was saying. No man wants to be called a pussy, excuse me for yeah. my language. No <laughs> man French. wants to be called a low link or something or a weak a weakling. Mm. No. So you will never admit that you have a problem. You always find excuses that oh, it's maybe it's work or maybe it's my Godzilla in home. order to achieve that. Oh, I don't have money. Wait, wait, wait. in order to achieve that mm. let him trust you okay that is when you give him peace he'll mm -hmm. be able to tell you but you know men we we are that type that we don't really mm. care about certain stuff mm. if i don't have money i have to walk home was so wrong i can just walk it's an exercise i don't mind but a lady will be like no i need to pick a taxi i'm tired mm. yes and so then... if i don't have money to pick taxi i wouldn't call you Mm. Yours is for me to return home and I'll come home. Kiss Then please. do you believe mm. that toys plays mm. a huge part in people's sexual lives, bad and good? Can you make the question personal to me please? <laughs> um, I said that is why I said do you believe? Do I believe? Do you Okay, what's your take? Mm. Maybe I should ask that. Mm. What's your take when it comes to sex toys mm. in 
in in in in in in, in like toy it's sex toys okay. in a whole you. relationship mm-hmm. thing i want to know the good part of it and mm-hmm. the bad okay. in your thinking in order not to put things across the wrong way let me put it in my own way <laughs> yeah, yeah. so the whole thing is i wouldn't mind if my partner is using it as a toy okay but do not make it a habit hmm i told you before there are different kinds of men different types this is where if i see you you know some men will see their partner with a male friend and gets angry yeah and some ladies think if he gets angry meaning he loves you no jealousy is not love mm mm-hmm. love starts with an air jealousy starts with something else mm. pushes somewhere mm. do you understand mm-hmm. yes and uh to use a toy i don't mind have fun but are you using it with me or when i'm not around you using it alone both whether you here or not sometimes i would want to play with my toys with you then meaning you are replacing me so i'll have to replace you too ha how i'm Why saying ha? you're not here masa 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 <laughs> let's say you're not here mm-hmm. and i'm using a toy yeah right because you're not here mm. but at the very same time i find toys that is why they call sex toys mm-hmm. it's something that we have to play mm. it's an as we we adding it mm. adding them extra as remember, an accessory remember we are partners we have become one of course so you have to use it when i'm around don't use it alone that is that is that is being being selfish but now mm. i have an edge right now mm. you're not here mm. and for me to get rid of this edge mm. it's maybe using toys mm-hmm. instead of calling joe from next door mm. to do the job the job i just want to get rid of this edge mm. and that time maybe as you say that i'm at work yes okay no problem i'm at work i also have this edge i have a secretary what happened I D I D I don't agree with you in that part cuz for me I feel that um, why should you think of only yourself and think not No 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 I'm not thinking only But from, I wouldn't mind whilst I'm in my office and you call me video call You be in a meeting Okay really okay have fun You in a meeting You at different. you at you, you at the meeting at that time yeah. you very busy your mm. days swamped back to back meetings and i have this urge mm. now and we, i have something at home that can get rid, can help me at you know that point you know there's something point. we call addiction but now at this point at that point it has nothing to do with addiction from the topic was the person is not performing mm. and now you are using sex toys automatically you're going to re- replace him with that sure Of course, I know ladies, that is how you are. Because at the end of the day, if you should get all your orgasm and everything from the toy mm. and me the human being providing, protecting, defending with my life, my sweat, my blood, you don't see or you don't have or don't get that from me. I become useless. But they say that it's that very important. That is when important. I become a slave. They say it's very okay, not they say. Mm. I believe that mm. Mm. it's very important. Mm. to understand yourself. If you have a, a toy person. and once in a while you use it. Yeah. And even if you're using it with your partner, I don't see anything wrong with it. So when when okay, so how often should we use toys? I wouldn't advise to use toys. At but all. you'd rather help your partner to get back on his feet or her feet. Okay, how often do you think partners should have sex in a week? Your partner is your one. You shouldn't deny your partner sex. How often do you think it's healthy to have sex healthy. in a week with your partner? Especially when you don't exercise. You can do it the whole week. No one cares. It's your strength. So, okay. And make sure after that you feed him well. And then okay. And then how do you find okay, how if if it's not abnormal, it's mm-hmm. when people have sex how many times in a week? if it's abnormal you find it it's abnormal okay okay let me come back you you want to get into my head you know everything so <laughs> you know everything it's cool sometimes you don't have to just have sex no okay sometimes just cuddling talking to each other that is when you have the time to discuss issues intimate be intimate Gosh. with your partner yes. 
Because sex is not... Sex is And sometimes, too, it shouldn't be just the sex. I told you, men are moved by what they see. Mm. When he sees too much of you, he will be tired of you. Oh! Eh? Okay. This I'm goes listening. to ladies that always show themselves naked. Hmm. If it goes on for a long time, he has had... It's like eating pap, pap every hey, day. This guy. <laughs> you will get tired. You understand? So you have to sometimes cover yourself, mm. look pretty for him, mm. and sometimes you have to go all naughty, look crazy. Okay. Mm. So too much of everything is boring. Ash. Can you eat is pap? that the reason Can that sometimes is that year? the reason that sometimes men go cheat because of they feel like they hate, no, they've been eating pap all the sometimes time? Sometimes it's not the fault of the men. I don't know. My guys are watching. Sometimes it's not the fault of the man. To go cheat? Yes. It's a decision. Cheating is a, it's a choice. Okay. I wouldn't say I'm nice, I'm cool looking or good looking or something. Mm. But this is where I go out and every lady is like, hello. Mm. Like, so if I'm having a problem at home, what do you think will happen? But it's a decision. It has nothing back. to do with me. No. The moment I smile back, I've given a green light. If but the lady is bold enough to approach me, she will get the number and she will get closer. Try, try, try. I don't believe mm -hmm. that mm. men sometimes mm. get out there mm. and do shenanigans mm. because of he sees too much of me. Mm or that I'm pashquying him too much, mm -hmm. or anything. Mm -hmm. Because I believe that should you feel some type of way in a relationship, it goes back, we sit. Try to find different things to enhance this relationship. Listen. And if really sex mm -hmm. is a factor in the relationship, if you feel like everything else is covered mm. the, 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 the the first thing that is important is sex mm. and it's not going the way you want it mm. i believe that you have to leave oh, really yes then don't call that person your partner ah. it's just the last something thanks for that answer it's so simple it's somebody really not a partner mm. <laughs> okay mm -hmm. is it true that but Any, remember, everything you do, you have to take the negative and the positive, positive. side. Is it true that... When you're leaving, mm, for when you're leaving, mm, remember, you will never get anyone like him. You can meet people that looks like him, but doesn't have his character. Mm, you can meet people that looks like him, that are rich, that does, does not respect anything. Mm, you meet people that will appreciate you, but it's not good looking like him. So you will never replace your partner, even if you go out there. You can't replace him. Yeah, but not you can replace somebody, but not your partner. Yes. Okay. Is it true that any woman can make a man come, but not any man can make a woman come? Yes, it happens. How? Because some people do not know where to even touch or where to even start from. But isn't it important to communicate with someone that your preferences when it comes to sex prior, maybe? Teach them how you want you want it. Men come faster than women. Okay. It will take a long time. That's why you're supposed to play with her first. So foreplay is very important. So when you start playing, that is when she's... If you do not know, she's going to teach you. Because now there's this thing that once trended on TikTok where mm. Zulu man said... Mm. I mean, I learned, I'm going to explain to you what mm. it means. I mean, I learned, I'm going to go to me. Never. I'm going to go to me. 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 It means that I would never muff a woman and go in where I talk to my ancestors with, with the same mouth that have muffed someone. So I don't do that. Mm. So. That is when they are dealing with spiritualism and spirituality. Obviously. But what does that has to do, your mouth, what does it has to do with muffing and is going? Just, it is just a respect. Some people have that belief. Oh, so wow. So they don't do their stuff. Then it means that you shouldn't do sex at all then, that's, if that's the case. Then how do you produce? How do you reproduce? But what, like, I don't understand where, where the purity comes from 
when it's just a mouth do and you see, your, okay, okay, your okay, private wait, parts wait, wait, combining. Wait, 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 wait. Do you see dogs naked before starting that? <laughs> your dog is always naked <laughs> in my eyes. Not even animals do that. It's over learning and trying to know more, trying to know more than you know. So we shouldn't, ma we shouldn't do such things as your blowjobs and your... We are your... humans. Some people have certain beliefs, so know your partner. Because you, you know why... I'm, because I'm... he cannot do that. Do you know why? why? You women are very powerful. Okay. Because creatures that can bleed every mm. month and mm. still walk normal like nothing happened. <laughs> you people are very dangerous. <laughs> yes. You, you know why, ne? Mm. Um... Every single month you bleed. <laughs> and you still walk normal. Because it's still in our nature, in come you. on. Hush. But it doesn't mean that I don't deserve to, to be muffed. It, I'm, I not think... saying, I'm not saying, I'm, I never said you're not, you don't deserve it. Mm. But know your partner. You see, this is how he is. This yeah. is what he can do. Yeah. This is his limit. Do not push him over his limit. Because that's, that's what I, I always say. Because that... even some men do not even come closer to their ladies when they are in their menstrual cycle or Yes, yes, even myself. I you can't in even that. come close. Yeah. For me, for instance, you can't come closer. Yeah, I believe in that as well. I wouldn't allow you to come closer, but I will come to you when I feel everything is okay. Do you understand? Okay. Or should I, should I enlighten no, you? No, I understand. Okay, fine. This is where, it's not a belief, but this is how I feel. That when you're bleeding, I'm supposed to allow you take away your waste stuff and your bad omen and everything to wash away so i'm supposed to allow you okay you understand mm. in order not to contract or bring anything home or bring any bad omen upon myself mm. for me being the head of the family mm. i'm supposed to allow you and you are supposed to allow me so i give you that distance mm -hmm. that doesn't mean i can kiss you or i can hug you or something mm. but i can't overdo it for you to get any bad mind or something to proceed or something. Mm -hmm. And some ladies are really honey when they, are, when they get into the cycle. Yes. Mm -hmm. So in order to, I wouldn't push you away. I'll bring you closer. Mm -hmm. But I will always engage you in a conversation that wouldn't bring your mind there. So simple. Okay. Because yeah. you know why I'm asking this mm -hmm. question that any, is it true that any man, any woman can make a man come and... A man cannot make any woman to come because I other other people they always want to bring um, their past sexual lives into the current. That is the mistake. Yes, because now you cannot do things that you were doing with Nomsa with me. Mm. My soft my 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 notes are different. Mm. My soft spots are different. Mm. My preferences are different. Mm. But now when you sit down and tell your partner, this is how I prefer it. It it always seems like you you questioning. The, 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 what they know about sexuality or you say you you, you insulting them mm. as if they are amateurs when it comes to sex. That why is, that is why do you should people know when and how to approach. But what if maybe mm. I just met you and mm. we got caught up in a moment mm. and at that moment I tell you how I want you to touch me. Will you will you be turned off? Because I'm I have an edge and for for you to be able to make me come, mm. it's for me to tell you where to touch, what you should do. And there's a saying that goes like this, something must kill a man. Huh? There's no way I'm going to be turned off when you tell me to do that. Okay, so it's the, the timing there when we're doing the deeds, it's always in that perfect. Moment, in that moment, yes. in that moment, it will be difficult for me to, take, to go off. Okay. Or uh, some men to mm. go off. So there's this thing mm. that they say, when a man is going to have a first encounter with a woman. I'm not saying when you are a virgin, mm. but let's say you just met mm. someone mm. and then obviously mm. the excitement is there mm. and always women should acknowledge that that's the first round it's for that guy because of yeah. the, the adrenaline, there's a rush already, the excitement mm. is there. So mm. you give it to them. Mm. Do you think it's okay to masturbate if you don't want to ejaculate very quick when you're with that person? Mm. Do you think you should you masturbate prior the moment i say to you baby i'm coming do you think 
you should take pills and potions do you think that you have take umuti that you took from babu makubane mm. drink so that mm. you can the the, the longevity long yes mm. okay everything depends on whoever or however you want your life to be mm. you remember i spoke of addiction mm mm-hmm. when you should always go like that mm. the day you do not have the pills on you meaning it's a lose lose for the guy okay <laughs> women should always understand okay this is how my guy is mm. the first round of every guy mm. this is how it lasts mm. some people have training so they can hold for longer mm. okay look at the fingers they are not the same mm. this is different this is different mm. yes mm. so are humans mm. everyone has his way or his star of coming mm. or doing something mm. so you should understand if your ex could do 20 minutes for the mm. first round mm. and the new guy is doing 30 mm. or let's say 15 minutes yes is either is a plus for you or a minus yeah, so yeah. you understand mm. then make sure after the first round give him something to 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 refresh his system come back to normal that is when you want him Do you think size matters to women? Most women think of size mostly and which is a very big mistake. Okay. Because they were using sex toys, heavy sex toys mm-hmm. and stuff. And now you've got the kind of man you want. That is why I was telling you do not use sex toys alone. This is where you're using dildos which are way bigger than you. And after you meet somebody's son who is rich, has everything and then he's not having up to the size of the dildo, what do you think will happen? But that is why women th- that is why some women end up cheating. But t- toys have sizes. Yes. And then it means that if the women have something they say I don't know whether you have you have an idea of it. They say the bigger the better, right? Okay, I don't believe in that. I'm going to come in. Mm, that, that is you, but yeah. out there. I'm talking of out yes, there. Cuz mm. now remember, if maybe you found me with mm. toys that you're not comfortable with, mm. you should be open to say, "Let's go, baby." And you go find a size that it's your size cuz dildos come in sizes as after well. using and after after using oversize or or the Mongolian size for for like 2 3 years uh, and I tell you to use Let me tell you something. A vagina. Mm. I'm not kissing. Mm. That's what it's called. Mm. A vagina is mm. like an elastic. Mm-hmm. So it can stretch and it can get, go back to normal. That is why we can give birth and still go back to normal and have normal sex. So that's not an issue in, in the whole situation. Mm. But what I'm saying is people should understand that not all toys have to penetrate. We have teasers. Mm. We have so many things. Mm. We have even toys that mm. I can wear it while you're at work. You can control it. Mm. So yes but with me mm. I I really don't believe that uh, size matters because the researchers they said mm. a woman can come while riding a, a, a horse mm. or a bike mm. of course it means that whatever that makes us come mm. it's not inside mm. so why should a, a size matters I believe that if you really uncomfortable mm-hmm. with whatever size your woman's toy is go find the one that can be suitable for her and for you that was what i uh, I, i said size really matters because mm. for instance i talked about addiction mm. if for instance you're using something that is way bigger mm. and all of a sudden because you met me and i'm not up to your standard You want to go for something that is small. Are you going to really enjoy? But 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 D, honestly speaking, I don't understand what is it with not up to the standard. Because I believe that women out there are saying bigger the better. Mina, I believe that mm. I can make mm. my partner come even if they far from me because there's you, a connection. You said something earlier about uh, a V being elastic that it contracts yes, yes. back. Yes. Yes, it contracts back, but remember, even elastic can lose its elasticity. Do you know mm-hmm. that? Mm-hmm. Mm. I know that. Of course. I so know some people that. have lost it. 
due to the use of toys. I want. I, I don't want to dispute that. Maybe you're talking from an experience that you have. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you felt, what is. <laughs> maybe you're talking from an experience where you felt like the VJJ has mm. this, the, 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 the the elastic mm. has stretched and all that. But all I'm trying to say to you is. Mm. All I'm trying to say is, mm -hmm. it's not inside, it's on top. That is why you're able to make your woman or your partner come. Okay, let me say you mm. can make your woman come mm. by just touching it, not penetrating you with your fingers. no idea and where some people's orgasms or soft spots are. And Someone can tell you the soft spot is in the fingernails. Are you kidding oh. me? <laughs> How am I supposed to bang that? Oh... Put it in warm water or cold water. <laughs> put it in my mouth. Are you kidding me? What I know is, what I know Ladies. is, you can make your partner come even if you are far from them. Because before the size and touching and penetration and all that, it's two people having a mutual feeling. A mutual you wouldn't feeling. be shouting harder if it, the inside doesn't work. No, no, no. I'm not saying it doesn't work. Oh, you work. don't? I'm asking you. I, I don't know when I'm in a moment. I don't know what I do. <laughs> when I'm in a moment, I don't so know what you I do. So you, you wouldn't be shouting harder? I don't know what happens to me when I'm in a moment. But all I'm trying to say I is... I think you 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 rather say, okay, why don't you scratch? No, no, no. Drifting? No, no, no. <laughs> you can make your partner come even if you're far away. Because yeah. of there's a mutual feeling yeah. and there's connection. So now... What is the, why should it be an obstacle if I have a mutual feeling with you and I'm connected with you? What does the size has to do with anything? While it's not inside, it's on top. Someone will tell you, why don't you hit my womb? Are you kidding me? Size don't matter. <sighs> to me, it doesn't. Hey, my sister, you're lacking. <laughs> and then I want to ask, would you date someone who's openly saying to you they are bisexual? From me? Yeah. For me? For you? Bye. It would be difficult. Why? <sighs> How should I put I, I'm, I'm trying to get stuck, but I know I'll come out of the matter. Mm. Okay, so um, the whole thing is, I think of what I want, not what you want. If I should go in for that, meaning I shouldn't have any problems with that. But would you date someone who's, who's bisexual and openly telling you that? that I'm into girls, I'm into boys, or I'm into girls, I'm into, I'm into, I'm into, I'm into women, and I'm into men. I, I, okay. I, I, I in, hate in, both in, sides. In, 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 in a more serious note and, and a straightforward okay. answer, I, 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 I wouldn't. Okay. But now let's come to let's switch to the bad boy section. The bad boy section. I'm a guy. My ladies into both ladies and me myself. That is a plus one. Have you forgotten? <laughs> <laughs> so you would date? Live, I would. Live, I wouldn't mind to have your girl. At the end of the day, I've got two holes for me. But mm -hmm. she didn't say mm -hmm. she's open to do it with you I'm, and another woman. She did not say mm. she would have you mm. at the very same time oh, no, or moment with another person. We are not dating. If Don't she's bother. dating you, she's dating you. Remember, you being, being you're, bisexual, it doesn't mm. mean that. Please listen. Mm -hmm. Being bisexual, it doesn't mean that you we will have two partners at once. Mm. It means that maybe there's a phase where I'm dating guys. Mm. When I break up with you, mm -hmm. there's a phase that I will be dating girls. But it doesn't mean that I'm dating you two at the same time because that's cheating. It's very good you answered yourself. Kiss close. So you wouldn't... I wouldn't. No, 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 no. My, you didn't get my question. My question wasn't saying I'm openly dating you and another person. That's open relationship. Remember you said your I friend said, was offended when the lady... Uh, told him about the weakness and stuff uh, what, are, what now, i'm let saying me, let me bring no 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 up. you didn't get if my question if you should dump me or let's say we break up and then you go in for a lady because i told you from you, the beginning that i'm bisexual. automatically you're telling you're telling me i'm weak no please i'm listen. not up to your standard i'm saying mm. i'm bisexual mm. when i'm in a phase mm. 
if I like you as a man mm. right mm. now, I'm I like you mm. or I love you and I'll date you. Mm. Even if maybe we get married, it means that I'll be with you. Mm. But now, if we break up, I'm still open to date women. Would you be offended by that? Yes. That I left you as a man and I went to date a woman? Yes. Oh, wow. Selfish. I'm not being selfish. I'm just being straightforward. It's an indirect thing. So you wouldn't date a, a person who says they're bisexual, period? If you're open to have... A, if you're open to share everything... That's... that's it's not cheating. I cannot... That's open relationship. That's the difference. Why don't you understand this? A who, a who you that is open to marrying 10 or anything and then now you, you're saying this? No, 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 no. <laughs> Mina, I don't have a problem. Uh -huh. If you wouldn't have a problem, uh -huh. if I'm the one, remember, I'm the one who's dating you and another uh -huh. person, uh -huh. but not that you dating the my person you. and me. No, That's no, the no, difference. No, no. I'm not saying because we've had, like, let's put it as another partner in uh -huh. there, uh -huh. I'm going to treat you equally. No. When you are first, you are first. No, 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 no. What I'm trying it's to say... In woman's mind. Jealousy. What I'm trying to say is, mm. even if mm. I date mm. you mm. and another person, mm. me and you being in an open relationship, mm. it doesn't mean that you have to chow where I'm chowing. Mm -hmm. We're not in a polygamy here. Mm. That's my person, mm. you my person. Go mm. find your other people mm. because of it's an open relationship. But I'm not open to have you and them. I can still date you. I don't mind. Okay. I can still so date now, you. Listen. Mm -hmm. I can still date you. Mm -hmm. But remember, if you're open to this, and at the end of the day, if you break up, you can go to that. Mm -hmm. Meaning I can also choose to be with a man. I don't have a problem if you openly said that you bisexual. I didn't say that. Out of what you did, that is what I would do. But it wouldn't affect me anyhow. Really? No. <laughs> you have no idea. Because if you're bisexual... In this era, with all the social media stuff... If you're bisexual, I think it's, it's easy for you to be open-minded if your mm. partner dates other people. Mm. I see. If maybe they tell you as well that they're bisexual. But the whole truth is, I wouldn't. It's making noise as well. Okay. Mm. And then... Uh, there's this thing. There's a there's a there's a there's a day I had a conversation with this guy called Tiniso. Shout out Tiniso Malinga. Uh, Tiniso said there are, there are different things in a woman. There's a soft spot. There's a precum. There's orgasm, and there are knots. And there are not knots. 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 K N O T S. So now, mm -hmm. if you are aware of these things, before I tell you what he said, mm -hmm. what's the definition of soft spot to you? Okay. To me, uh, I would say you are my partner. Mm -hmm. You should know when and where, or even if it should even be a soft spot as in me touching you before you should know. Mm -hmm he's ready for this or he wants that. Okay. It could even be a gaze, just a normal gaze. Okay. Yes. And then what is a pre-cum? <laughs> that could even happen in all this kind of hand jobs and stuff. What is orgasm? That is the way climbers end. What is a cum? Hmm? What is a cum? That is the ending of the whole thing. To your satisfaction. What is what are not that you 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 can even boldly say, I'm okay now. I'm free. I can sleep. What is not? What are not? Why are you pushing all this? <laughs> <laughs> because mm. that day I had a conversation with Ukeniso. Ukeniso said. Let me tell you. Mm. Soft sports, mm. it's discovering triggers mm. in your person. That's what I'm saying. Yes. He said... I know that when I look at you like this, mm -hmm. you should know what I mean. pre -cum, coming closer. Okay. And then he said... I remember someone did something like... Mm -hmm. I was like, what the fuck? 
Then later, I, I was like, really? Because I saw the guy smiling. I was mm. like, oh, really? Okay, that's where you're going. And okay. Like, mm. And then he said, pre-cum, it's that, it's that waterish cum that it's uncontrollable. Mm. Uncontrollable. More mm. especially, it happens when you... You 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 in the process of it all. Yeah. Yes. The beginning. Yes, and then he said an orgasm. Mm. It's an emotional calm. That is when you feel all your feels. Electrical, what what? That is the full connection over one thousand voltages. Okay, and then he said a calm. It's physical. So he said there's a difference between an orgasm and a calm. Mm. Orgasm, it's an emotional calm. Mm. From that orgasm, you therefore transform. To a calm. Then the whole thing ends. With that, that is when you breathe like, ah, I'm done. And then he said, mm. notes, it's a journey to coming. It's when those that the, we call the corners. Changes. And the corners in a mm. woman. Yes. It's finding the corners. Mm. That is why I told you. If inside doesn't matter, why would someone shout harder? So it's when someone is hitting the knots. Okay. And then in closing... Because she ends up changing in different moods. In closing, would you agree... And some people also get tired there. They do what? Some people get tired in the knots. They get tired. What is to get tired? It means that the sex stops... It goes off. Let's say, for instance, hitting the nuts, then the lady is Comes. like, okay, go yeah, on, yeah, go yeah. on, go on. Who gets tired? And then the guy over excitement comes. Oh. That okay. is leaving you in between. Yeah, so it, that's when... It so would, that is what is actually killing people. So that's when... Killing most of the relationships. So that's when they say a woman can make a man come, but not any man. Okay. And then in closing, mm. would you agree if your partner tell you that they, they have... A fantasy of threesome. Can you allow them? Married or not married? It doesn't matter. A f- a fantasy cannot. A fantasy. Can I ask you a question. Yeah, it doesn't matter species. because I need, I need a sincere answer, just a straightforward. No, one. no, no. For me, this question. No explanation. Please, please. please, please okay, listen. go on, go on. Carry. This question to me, mm. it has nothing to do whether you're married or not, mm. because of it's a fet- it's a it's a it's a fantasy. Mm. A fantasy can take your whole life. Mm right mm. whether married or not mm. would you allow your partner mm. to come to you and say babe i have a fantasy of having a threesome let's mm. take a trip go out there mm. find a woman mm. and i want to see you in action mm. or let's go take a man out there mm. i want you to see me in action but i want you to be involved i don't want to do it with other people but you and we should come back in that And then marriage. we come back normal like and be as because of you be fulfilling my fa- my fantasy as your woman. It wouldn't work. <laughs> it's so simple. What do you mean? Why? Because it's not like we're going to be in relationships uh, with those let me, people. Let me show you something. Okay. If I have a bottle mm. and I drink from the bottle, mm. I close it. Mm. I put it down. Mm. You're tasty. You saw this water. You asked, babe, is that yours? I say, oh, fine. Cool. You can take it. After you using it, anyone at all can, who is tasty can also take it. You Where know you why. No, no, no. I'm going mm. somewhere. Okay. But what if I have a glass of water mm. and I dip my hand in it and I drop it and you come, you, babe, I'm tasty. Can I do? And I say, no. And you say, why? I tell you, I dip my hand in it. Would you drink? No. Would someone that knows that I dip my hand in it, would he also drink? No. It's so simple, so think about it. No, I, I'm not thinking of anything at You're this point. You're not thinking. Your scenario. It? Okay, your now scenario. I'm bringing it out. Okay. A bottle can be washed, cleaned, put, set back. But that water that my, I dipped my hand in it, or you dipped your hand in it, or another person that dipped his hand in it cannot come back to me. I cannot take it. No, I would not let my partner have another man or woman. It's me and you. That is why we are called partners. So simple. And then aren't you scared that maybe I'll go out there and fulfill my, 
my fantasy without you being part of it. Because if I do it with you, I'm not cheating. Mm. Cheating is doing something that your partner doesn't know about. Now, won't you be scared that I will call Why don't you drink the glass of water I offered? R-A-D. Mm. Aren't you scared that your partner will go out there and fulfill the fetish that you didn't want to partake in it? And now that's cheating. If you have kids with me, you are free to go and fulfill your fantasy. Continue with your fantasy. Don't come back. Okay. You answered me. What's your fetish? Other people have foot fetish. Be mm. Like, oh, I get turned on when I see a girl with nice feet. Mm. What's your fetish? <laughs> Others be like, oh, I like the legs. Mm. What's your fetish? Okay. Oh, should I give you my spec? Your fetish. A woman with six packs. Japan. Thank you very much. Well-trained, okay. athletic body. That's your fetish. Mm. Thank you very much. Thanks for giving me a space. My Google type, no. <laughs> <laughs> Belly, yeah. no. Let's close it. I'm so down with you. Thank you very much for this. Um, thank you for your time. Uh, thanks for having me here. Thank you. Really appreciate it.